Now, uh, turning to domestic policy, Senator Paul, if you win, you're the president of the United States, will you enforce the federal drug laws against Colorado and Washington state that have legalized dope uh, for sale in those states? I think that uh, states should have uh, the ability to make these uh, decisions. But the federal law exists and it says that's illegal. Are you going to abdicate that prosecution ability? What I've advocated for is allowing um, the federal government not to intervene with regard to medical marijuana, and that's the only decision I've made, is that I would allow states to uh, have medical marijuana uh, and make the decisions on medical marijuana within the state lines. But, of course, in Colorado and Washington State, it's not medical marijuana. It's all marijuana anytime by anyone, and that's contrary to federal law. You, you would be taking an oath to uphold the federal law and the Constitution would that commit you to prosecuting in that state those people selling dope? Most of the time that I've spent in the last several years hasn't been really with regard to federal oversight of you know Colorado specific law. What I've spent time is trying to find out a way where our criminal justice system is is more appropriate and that the punishment uh, fits the crime. And so I've been opposed to you know people selling three hundred dollars worth of marijuana and getting fifty five years in prison. And so I really haven't taken a position with regard to Colorado's law. I will tell you that my general inclination is to try to give states more freedom to uh, make a lot of these decisions. 